Okay, now I'm gonna call myself to the stand, right? Now, this is me proving that the devil is all around me. So you have to look at it. See, so this is to prove that I can read and write. See, so this part is in writing. This is when they took, they turn out my lights. I was in my house with no lights and no water for three years. So instead of me tripping, I just started writing it, right? So in this, some of it, you can, I'm gonna read some of it. Veteran Tommy Chancey Council Senior is asking the United States Attorney's Office for, for concourse, for which it is when a civil case becomes a criminal case under Scott law. This has happened when veteran Tommy Chancey Council Senior filed civil and then they, filed, see that's when they, they redacted it out. That's what I'm reading right there. So that's the case number in Seminole County in the civil courthouse in the state of Florida and was denied due process and veteran Tommy Chancey Council Senior was placed in criminal court in Seminole County with case number 2008-MM72218. Now you can look that case number up. See, they forgot the, they forgot the, I don't know if y'all can zoom in or whatever, but they forgot the, that one. <laughs> they missed that one. See, that's what I'm trying to tell you. And then the veteran, Tommy Chancellor Calvin Sr. opened up another silver case that was in the case, court, uh, case number 08 C A one six one eight zero nine. Now that's the case where I emancipated us in that case, right? Because I had that's when they put me in criminal court after they had me in civil court. See, this is me testifying to you all, and I'm chronicling it so it wouldn't be hearsay. Now let me show you what the definition of hearsay is, right? Now this is this is why this book is is like a teacher's manual because I'm breaking it down. I'm breaking down everything I'm saying. Now, hearsay evidence is, and this is the legal definition of hearsay evidence. Uh, well, it's the collegiate, evident, um, collegiate definition because the legal definition only says evidence and it says see evidence. So I'm gonna go to the collegiate definition of hearsay evidence, which is evidence-based not on a witness's personal knowledge, but on another statement not made under oath. See, that's when I then would call the Prophet Muhammad, right? Now that's, see, that's when it would be hearsay evidence for me. I don't, see, I don't know what he said until now. So I'm bringing in the Shihi International um, version of the Prophet Muhammad's testimony in chapter 53 verses uh, 27 through 28, it says, indeed those who do not believe in the hereafter name the angels female names, right? And they have thereof no knowledge. They follow not except assumption. And indeed assumption avails not against the truth at all. See, so now this, that's, that's me, right, telling y'all the truth for which has be, be, been opened up in the civil courthouse in Seminole County in the state of Florida for all around about nine years, 11 months. Now, that's at the time that I wrote this, nine years and 11 months, it, I, I opened up this case and, and uh, has been um, denied due process in the case for over nine years. And now veteran Tommy Chancey Calvin Sr. has opened up a federal case in the Middle District of Florida. Now that's this case. Now that's after nine years. See, how can this be hearsay when I'm telling you and then showing you the devil in the details? See, that's why I don't understand why I'm being destroyed. I mean, here it is right here, man. My family saw the devil take all my stuff because my wife was with me. My kids was with me. They saw the devil take everything. But now you don't see me tracking him down. See, I'm saying, I'm telling you, like I'm saying in federal court in the middle district of Florida with case number 618 dash 
CV-243-0RL-0 dash dash 41GJK. That's the actual case number. Veteran Tommy Chancellor Council Senior took an oath to protect and defend the United States Constitution in August of 1987 and on August 12, in 2008, veteran Tommy Chancellor Calder Sr. was a man of his word and legally defended the United States Constitution inside of the Civil Courthouse in Seminole and Orange Counties in the state of Florida, and then it's kind of, oh, as well as in the Civil, uh, uh, Civil Courthouse in Seminole County in the state of Florida. And then that, you know, see, and then it goes to the evidence. See, so that's my testimony.